Hi, in this tutorial, we are going to learn about looked at both base command and few more commands in future command manager. Open new SOLIDWORKS document and start new sketch on front plane. Make one center rectangle somewhere here. It will be 45 millimeters to 20 millimeters. Make sure the center of rectangle is in vertical position with origin point and add distance between origin point and center of rectangle with 50 millimeters. Exit the sketch and start new sketch on top plane. Go normal to top plane and create one ellipse somewhere here that will be 30 millimeters and the profile will look something like this exit the sketch and use in future lifted bows base command in lifted bows base command we have few options Profiles, start and end constraints, guide curves, center parameters, center line parameters, sketch tools, option, team, future, curve it to display. Uh, in first, we'll learn about profiles. So select the profiles, the two profiles that you will want to merge. Change the direction up. Change this direction. Also in uh, start and end constraints, I will use for start, con start constraint normal to profile. Also for end of constraint normal to profile. If I change uh, this green point, uh, you see I am uh, getting a uh, different profile. This is okay. I will use also thin future 0.5 millimeters and uh, I will change a little this tangent line here. I want it to be something like this and this one is okay. Exit the lifted thin feature. I will change the, prof the rectangle profile a little. Uh, go in on this arrow, sketch one, right click, edit sketch. I will add fillets on the sharp edge. Click OK. Click OK and exit the sketch. So we have a problem now. What's the problem? We have a problem. Again, change the point. Normal profiles. Team future already selected. And okay, now is nicer. On uh, this uh, face here, I will create one sketch normal to mm, center line, but before that, I need one center line. Create center rectangle. Same dimension, 45, 20, fillet edges, 
k and go future both base 0.5 millimeters unselect merge results click ok other uh, comment in future command manager that we will learn today is a uh, fill pattern it's a very useful comment i will use a polygon two millimeters this will be five millimeters this will edge for uh, the direction this will be three millimeters create seats the seats will look circles 0 0.4 0 0.6 0 0.5 0 0.5 and this future i want to cut just this future not the all um, profile and click ok here is it nice I will add uh, fillets 0.3 millimeters on these edges. Okay, beautiful. Uh, now I will create again one uh, lufted thin feature. To do that, I need to create one reference plane that will be parallel to this face here, 60 millimeters. 65 and click OK. I will create one sketch here that will be oops, that's okay. Circle. I will create one circle. The circle will be in center in this line and it will be 10 millimeters. Click OK. Uh, now I want to add a few guidelines for my profile. To do that, I will sketch on the right plane and uh, I will use command spline start. I will add the later relations. So this point have to be with relation with this profile here and this point will be in relation with this profile or this lane pierce again I will change the view of this line okay and again one spline on the this side same pierce to this profile pierce to this line change a little the look of the line This will be the hole there. Exit this sketch. And now create one reference plane that will be parallel on front plane. And for second reference, use this point here. Click OK. Normal to sketch on plane two. Gain spline. Again, spline line. Just now we will create one more lane like this lanes two. Click mirror. Okay. 
this point and this circle pierce this point and this ellipse pierce nice and that's okay go in a future looped both base again profile one to be sketch two profile two will be this sketch here guides okay this line again this line and this line Okay, so here is our profile. Team future 0.5 and click OK. Here is our profile. Hide these two planes. It's nice. I will add one more thing on the holder here. To do that, I need one reference plane, 10 millimeters, 20 millimeters from front plane. Change the other direction. 10 millimeters and click OK. Sketch on plane 3. Create one center line. Again, spline. Select spline line and this line here, mirror and exit the sketch. Now go to split line and this sketch here, this face here, correct single direction and OK. I will change the color of this face. I will go from this appearance. I will add this color. Okay. This thing and this. So lofted one, lofted one, and uh, lofted two will be other color. Also at this face. Okay. Nice. And here is our shower profile. Not bad. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned. Bye bye.